everybody, it's Ruby. Today we're gonna do a quick review on the Rydell Cruise. It's been over a year, about a year. It's been about a year that I've been using these roller skates. I took the toe stops off for now. When I unboxed them, they were new and they had these light blue toe stops on them. But yeah, let's get to it. Okay, so price-wise, these retail at about $250. Could be more, it depends on the store and where it's located in the US or internationally. I'm sorry if they are already pretty dirty. You know I've been using them a lot. So Rydell is a pretty brand name. They make really good ice skates, roller skates, both outdoors and indoors. And they are a reputable brand. So into the review. I have the Rydell Cruise and I also have the Rydell Zones. They fit very differently. With the Rydell Zones, I had to break into the skate for a very long time, a couple, a couple of months. They were very stiff in the beginning and I had to wiggle myself in every time. And it hurt very much to use it in the beginning because it's very stiff around the ankle area. I was a beginner, so it was a hard time. It took more effort to break in compared to if I would have used it right now when I am an intermediate skater. It would have been easier. So as a beginner skater, the Rydell Zones were a very uncomfortable skate, but the rewards are for later. Once I broke into it, I feel like I could do all the tricks in it. It offers the right amount of support it fits my feet very well. I am leaning towards being narrow-footed. Plus, the color of the Rydell Zones are very me. Like, just look at my outfit right now. It's brown and the Rydell Zones are kind of a tan color. It fits my outfits and roller skating. Well, how does that one compare to the Rydell Cruise? Okay, so first of all, um, just the material of it is very different. This is more of a hard leather. It's very stiff. The, the Rydell Zones are like a suede material. And if you look at the inside, it looks very spacious. Unlike the Rydell Zones where it really clings to your feet. Okay, so for dance skating, I would pick the Rydell Cruise more because it gives me a ton of support without being clingy. I sound like a guy who doesn't want a relationship, but it's the truth. So when I dance, the Rydell Cruise give me enough, a lot of support, doing a lot of tricks that involve toe manuals, such as spins, corkscrews, heel toe flares, and just all the kind of hip hoppy jam skate moves. If I do back bends on my toes, it would look like this. And because the boot is hard, it supports the rest of your feet. Maybe it would have been easier for me to learn if I had better plates. Okay, so if you have any questions of any sort about the Rydells that I have, Rydell Cruise, Rydell Zones, I have my Moxies as well, and I have tried other skates like JH Skates and Kaya Skates that I have other reviews on in my channel. And I would love to hear more from you. What do you want? Please put it in the comments if you can. But if not, it's totally fine. Please do follow me on my socials. I am Ruby Relin on everything Instagram, TikTok. YouTube. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification button for more videos like this from me to you. That's it. I've worked hard to edit these videos for you so I would really appreciate it if you support me. Thank you so much and I hope you guys have a nice day. It's sunset right now um, where I'm filming in LA. So yeah, see you next time.